Hey guys, Andy Wright's out here. Bookmakers Review Friday is payday, as we like to say. Let's keep the good times rolling here in Major League Baseball. A doubleheader that we're going to pick out today. Two games, one at 7.07 p.m. Eastern and one game at 8.10 p.m. Eastern to see if we can clinch a beautiful Friday here on the diamond. Let's take a look at the games we're looking at today. In that 7.07 start, it's going to be 9.13, 9.14 here, and that is going to be the New York Yankees and the Toronto Blue Jays. If we take a look at the line here, it's roughly a pick them. Minus 110, minus 106 split between Marcus Stroman and Yusei Kikuchi. Kikuchi, the left-handed pitcher, he actually is having a decent season, but struggling as of late. The interesting part about Marcus Stroman is that XFIP is way too high, particularly on the road over the past 60 days. The ability to hit now starts to turn the corner for the Toronto Blue Jays, who all of a sudden should be able to wake up at the plate and handling their business against the New York Yankees. If we take a look at Stroman versus Kikuchi, the total in this game is listed at 8. I believe we are going to be able to get nine or more runs between Stroman and Kikuchi. Both of these lineups should be able to hit each one of these pitchers, and with the ballpark, up in Toronto, we know that those fences have been moved in at the beginning of the year. I believe we're going over the total, so we're going to go over eight runs between the New York Yankees and the Toronto Blue Jays. Game number two we're going to take a look at. It's Cleveland, and it is the Kansas City Royals. Should have a good weather hitting environment in this game starting at 8, 10 p.m. and a rotation number of 9, 15, 9, 16. If we're looking at this game overall, overnight line was 10. It's dropped a little bit to 9.5. We're also going to go over the total here. If we're looking at Tristan McKenzie, one of the guys I've been fading the entire season. Why? Well, he's got some high XFIP numbers, which means he is dancing between the raindrops here. Some good performances, some bad performances. If we're looking at that Cleveland lineup going against Marsh, I believe they will be able to hit as well, even though it's a pretty high number, meaning 10 runs for us to cash in. I believe it's the right play here. So we're going to go two totals here and taking them to the over here. That is New York and Toronto over eight runs. Second game, Cleveland and Kansas City over nine and a half. Let's do double duty tonight on a Friday night and cash in some tickets. Come on, man. I know we can do it, and we'll head into the weekend in style. I'm Donnie Wrightside for Bookmakers Review, and always good luck on those wagers.